What's up guys, Ultra Nerd Show here, back again playing Ark Survival Evolve on the Ragged Rock map here on our house, or at our house on top of the smithy is what I meant to say. Um, so just some updates, let's go ahead and just start with the house since the last episode of building the shelter which you saw. Um, just inside I kind of added this whole little section thing because I wanted to put a uh, fireplace in here with it sticking out of the roof so I just built that up that little section. So I put a little bedroom up in here. Um, like you've seen before and still some of the dinos in here Everything else I think is the same, but you can see the Fireplace sticking through the roof there and I like that a lot then over at the base here. So I got a bunch of the uh, Whatever you call them railings put up and just kind of sectioned out some areas Don't know exactly how I'm gonna leave it just kind of designed it I did tame this which was around my base. I think up in up in that area over there It's like a level 100 so I tamed it up Then I'm gonna put the dodos out over here um, so then we got some more dinos that you've seen all this and then they just kind of laid out some areas here Again, don't know exactly what they're gonna be and how they're gonna look and everything, but this is of course Our base that we built on last time so I've kind of rearranged stuff so I put this Crafting station here and I craft up some stuff that I need to take off So I have some refining forges that I want to place down and then can we carry? Oh, yeah, we still have plenty of room because I wanted to do some taming, but I also want to do upgrades in like uh, equipment and uh, go into like more electricity type things. So I'm trying to get stuff increased for that. So let's run over here and we'll go ahead and put the refining forges there. And so I'm just going to place them over here just so I can get more uh, places put down to get more metal crafting so we can then increase stuff and we'll just place all of these down real quick and then I can um, after I'm done go get more metal there we go there so I have four more that I can start crafting metal and a higher thing so I can fly up around the place and stuff and get metal and then next up what I want to start doing which is what I'm Kind of most, I'd say mostly going to do today. Don't know exactly. I should have brought a dino with me. But over here I want to build what I'm going to call like a workshop area. So I already put a foundation here kind of like measured, not measured, but like looked at the area and everything. And so I'm just going to place a bunch of foundations here um, all along. I don't have any particular design in mind. Um... Yeah, we will go over at least one more. Let's see, what do we have? This is a four. Yeah, this is a four wide. I think that'll be fine. Um, yeah, because this is going to be something I walk dinos up into. Let's go ahead and put stuff back down here. Um, oh gosh, thought that placed in the, like that one did. I placed in the wrong spot. Okay, so then I'll pick this up here. So that's as far back that I'll just kind of maybe throw something back in here or something. Have a little walkway just in case stuff goes back there. And then we can place foundations in the front. Now I don't know exactly how big I want this to be. Um, and I can always just add more stuff to it later. Let's go at least one more since I have the foundations and I need to tear out this rock. But I'm going to have a, you know, so I can walk a dino in. Um, yeah, I'm trying to think. Yeah, I'll just do that. Um, we'll go ahead and tear this. Go ahead and get flint from it because I always need some flint. Okay, so I got flint, even though I probably should have, now that I'm thinking about it, put those forges over here. <laughs> Did not think about that at all. Okay, so let's get rid of this so I can see. Yeah, that'll probably... Let's just go ahead and place some more. Come on, I don't want to place in the ground. There we go. Place all of these. And like I said, I don't have any sort of designs or anything. I'll have to figure out something over here. Um, 
because it's hard to get dinos up and over unless I because of this stuff so unless I walk them like over this way and down um, and I'll probably just put a dino gate on the front I won't have any doors on it or anything just leave it open and I'll you know block off the sides with something I don't know exactly what I'll do there yet uh, but let's run up here to our crafting stuff I think it's up at this base I probably will pick up those forges and replace them over there like I said I completely forgot about wasn't even thinking because all this stuff will probably be moved um, but let's go in here and I wanted to so I have a crafting station that I picked up because I had to uh, just build a new one and place it over and the one you saw there and of course all that stuff won't be there anymore I'm just using it until I get the stuff built but let's go in here into um, crafting yes fabricator is what I want so I'll do it is S plus and that's what I need because I need electronics because I want to get into electricity and stuff I want to have that building or whatever being crafted and working into that so I have that going on um, okay so let's go ahead and I probably actually need to run over yeah, I still have weight run over here and we'll look at this crafting so you see what we need to build because I do want to do um, the dino gate stone dino gate and we'll craft uh, two of these one for each in and then I don't know what I want to make I was gonna make this workshop out of Adobe or yeah cl yeah Adobe but I don't ha would have to go over to the sand air and get all the stuff gathered um, so I'm just gonna do it in stone for now and then I can replace it later but we got that and I don't know what else I want to do um, I don't know what do we have in here to work with a bunch of wood stuff so I do need that I thought about maybe doing I know it's pretty much the same but just doing whole walls of the stone railings that way it has some you know open and airiness to it but it's still closed off a little bit more and then once I switch to Adobe I could change all that or just leave it um, so let's see how many we can make we can do 100 yeah, I'll just go ahead and do that. Why not? And I actually want it to be metal because I love the way metal looks. I wish there was like a cement and not just stone. Um, but yeah, so I'll go ahead and let this craft up and then I'll bring it back and we'll start placing the stuff down. I'll see what else I can make because yeah, I want to do this, but I need electronics. So I need to get silica pearls. So I did get a crossbow and some arrows and there is some out in the water right out here on the other side of the base that I saw. So of course it's super dangerous in the area though and there are piranhas and all sorts of stuff so I'm hoping I can swim down to it um, but we'll just have to see how it goes so I will let all that stuff craft up and I'll get some silica pearls in the meantime and I will see you then okay so I made it back now and I was only able to grab one stack of silica pearl or one grouping because I kept getting attacked and killed by piranhas and drowning and it just was not a fun time but let's go ahead and place I forgot to get uh ramps i don't know if that'll make a difference let's go ahead and put this back for sale let's take the rg fly over here everything just seems so slow like when i was in the water i was moving so slow even though i had dumped a lot of stuff off me into the bird and stuff's not overweight i just don't know what's what's wrong but now my health's taking forever to regen back and i don't know what's going on with that but let's go ahead and take these ramps and I have some of the railings I was able to grab half the stack but at least I did get uh, some silica pearls though so that should get some get me started with some electronics and that should be a-okay fine okay so let's come over here and we'll place down I think I need to because I did extend some out I just I'm gonna I was like I'm just gonna use up all of these foundation so I extended it out and I of course need to put some stuff underneath it but I think it'll be fine for now there we go and now let's put the gate on which I believe is on whoa I can't see hardly yeah I think that's fine the way it is right there yeah I think that looks 
A-OK -okay to me. Now we'll run this in and do the same thing. Like I said, I probably won't even use this side for anything, but you never know. And then put the gate up there. So there we go. So now we've got that. And now we can start placing down some of these stone things. I'll just probably do a layer here. Oops, that's not what I wanted. Around here like this is what I will do. And then we'll start placing it, which I don't know exactly how I'm going to put stuff. I should probably put up, uh, keep placing in the wrong areas, put up some, uh, whatever you call, um, can't think of what they're called, like storage units, um, which probably eventually should do vaults because they can uh, be, you know, hold a lot more and stuff, things, but let's, come on, pick up. There we go. Okay. I just whistled something and I don't know what I whistled at all. Hopefully it was nothing bad. But let's check it out. Okay, so now we have the S plus crafting station and a fabricator. Which um we'll go ahead and place the fabricator down. I don't know which side I want it on. Maybe this side. Of course let's go into K mode. And maybe over to one side like this. Let's see if we can straighten it up a little bit. Just a little bit more. It looks like I want just a smidge over. Okay. So we've got this. Um, let's go ahead and... I don't know how long this is to know if I'm like halfway or anything. We'll just go ahead and place it right here. See if we can get it lined up with this edge. There we go. So we have the fabricator now. So that's awesome. Let's see. I know you have to put gas, so I definitely need to get gas, which is another thing. But let's see. So we can do the grinder, the forge. Chemistry bench is what I really want, but we need electronics. Let's go in here. Oh, yeah. I forgot I need. Um, Got to go into here and type in electronics there which is meddling and silver pearls so yeah I can definitely craft up a bunch of that I just need to get the gas is what I need um, gas which I hardly I don't even have any gas so I'll have to worry about that in a little bit then let's put this maybe on this side not exactly sure let's just go ahead and K mode it and then I also need to put a smithy in here as well. I'm going to put it right here in the middle. There we go. So we've got that. And then I think that's all I have on me. Yeah, just more railings and everything. Let's go ahead and put the silk pearls in here so we've got them in there. Don't have to worry about carrying them around. Don't have to get metal transferred over here. I'll pick up all those forges, craft a smithy, and I think maybe see about some gas I know I have some oil but I don't know anything about or if I have anything in regards to actual gas let's see if I have anything stored up in here real quick I may have to run and get gas somewhere yeah there's nothing in there I know I have some gas in here I keep hitting the wrong button a little bit of oil oil is what I'm talking about not gas and I think maybe some in here a 90 yeah so I can go ahead and take these I don't remember what the crafting thing is but let's go ahead and just shoot them in there here we go it's 60 okay so it'll at least craft up some enough to get us running and which is crafting up right now so I'll let that happen and I'll try and maybe get some more gas I'm gonna pick up all these of course let's go ahead and get our since we're building I'll get my gun out dang it go and replace it there let's pick up all of these and then of course we can move them and then I need to craft a new smithy let's see if we can what do we need for a smithy metal ingots and wood which should be easy because that all should be in here metal ingots and some wood we will craft an S plus smithy 
And so we've got that. So I'll, like I said, I'll do all that stuff, move these forges and all that sort of thing. And I will do that and I'll bring it right back. So I'll see you then. Okay, so I got stuff put up down here now. So I did get um, stuff put in here, the silk pearls, the gas that was crafted up and some metal. So let's go ahead and come into, uh, is it Miss, oh no, composites there. And so it's three to one uh, metal ingots. And so I'm pretty sure we're good about that. Oh yeah, we gotta turn it on. And then craft all 60 um, so that gives us 60, which is a good number to have. I don't, this is the S plus, so it's very quiet, so you can't hear. So it's going to uh, kind of annoy and distract me. Um, I did have an extra smithy here, or I ended up cleaning off the, uh, my patio thing off my house. And so I have an extra smithy. I'll just kind of stick it in there. And I do have the other two refining forges and then the table that we'll put down somewhere. So let's go ahead and stick the refining forges down here. Let's go back in the K mode again and I'll place these down. Uh, they're not perfect, but it'll be as close as I can get. Okay, and then I can't remember. Nope. And the last one here. Then I just need to go get more metal and have it uh, put in here to craft up and everything. So that gives us a lot of metal options. So let's go here now and we'll put the table down right next to the smithy table. Or the S plus I guess it is. While I was doing stuff there was another one of the weird storms and it was just crazy like I've never experience those storms but everything just gets super windy and annoying and everything super loud okay and then we got our mortar and pestles or whatever you call them to put up the table looks so small I thought it looked much bigger than that but oh well so let's kind of just throw them up here on the table like that Put these all along up here. And the last one. Oh, hitting all sorts of buttons. Sure, I'll just stick it there. So there we got all our mortar and pistols back now. I do have on the bird a bunch. I won't pick it up, but I do have a bunch of the charcoal I pulled out from the um, forges that were up there. So I do need to add those, and I'm trying to think of what else. Let's see, so we do have, oh, they're already done. Um, so let's go in here. So we do need to craft this. I need two of them, so what do I need? More metal. So I need more metal. I think there's metal in here. Oh yeah, um, I don't remember how much I need. We'll take the small stack though for now. Place that, let's see, electrical. Can we craft? Ooh, we can. So I just need two. One for this place, one for the house so I can run a refrigerator and things. Then let's see if we can do more crafting. I really want this chemistry bench. I need polymers, everything, some mini paste. I need a frog. That's what I need. I want to build the industrial forge at some point too. Yeah, the, that's not too bad. Okay, we'll go to... Nope, not that. So I need wood in here, and then I can't craft that yet. So let's grab some wood. I do have the beaver sitting right here. I was like, do I even have wood on it? But I did just go get wood to fill up everything. Okay, let's go electrical, and we will craft two of those. And again, I can't do that. Let's see what else we can do. Canteen, nope. Oh yeah, we don't want the structures. The vaults, of course, that we'll get into later on. Any bed? Nope. That. Oh, we're way off on that stuff. So it's pretty much all we can craft right now. But let's go ahead and take these two. Do I have... Um, let's see, can you craft it in here? I would think not, but let's... Um, maybe it's in this thing over here. Let's go with uh, miscellaneous maybe? Nope. Crafting. 
Oh, we did that. I don't know where you craft. Um, that's not what I want. I don't know where you craft the power cords. Let's see if I need... Oh, I have, well, I have unlocked that one. Requires electric generator, which we have that fabricator. So it is a fabricator. I wonder why. Maybe because it's not S+. Plus. Um, we'll go ahead and do the vertical one as well. And that should be, I don't, I'll just go and unlock all of these. Just so we have it all unlocked. And we should be good now. So now let's check. Go in here and we'll do. There we go. So we need probably just, um, we already did the boxes. We need just probably two. Yeah, we'll go with two. And then this will just be able to, you know, stick off the generator and everything. So let's come in here. We'll pick out the generator and then the cable. I don't know exactly where I want to place in here. Probably on this side somewhere. So let's go with... Now the thing is, I got to remember... where the cable comes out from. I like it sitting in that direction, but let's see where the cable sticks out. So it sticks out on that side. Okay. Um, so let's pick this up, place it again. And this time we will, oh, I just had it the way I wanted right there. And now we'll go with, yes, place that out. And then we can throw the electrical box, place it there at seven. There we go. So now we have power and this should be able to run to it. Obviously, it's too far away. I would probably have to add more, but I can uh, plug that in now as well. I don't know if maybe once electricity is fit, it'll reach over there, but it, I don't know. It should be fine there. And let's get on the bird and run up to the house. And we gotta try and fit this stuff in the house. I'll have to probably move the, uh, whatever you call it, the um, spark powder, or not spark powder, the. Uh, I don't know what it's called. This thing. The preserving bin, that's what I wanted to say. Um, so let's go with... Of course this thing is ginormous. I don't know where we should... Maybe we can stick it on the outside. Um, I wonder how tall... I, of course I don't have a refrigerator. So I wonder how tall, because I'd probably stick it over in this corner, because I, I need to move this anyways. Let's see, let's go ahead and hit the Q. Oh, it's probably not going to fit. So let's Q this so it will stick backwards. Let's go ahead and just stick it there and then we need the six, the cord to the back. Like that. And then I can see the box. It's right there by the fire. So we have that place now. And so we should be able to put the refrigerators. And I'll probably put the refrigerator here. Maybe two of them. One for meat and one for eggs. If I ever have any eggs. And then move the preserving bin down or in this corner or something. Something along that. And then now... I want to pick up all of this area. Of course, now it's going to complete. I just thought about that. It's going to completely. Uh, can I not get it? Pick up the standing torch. But yeah, it's going to completely mess up this whole area here. Um, which shouldn't be too hard to fix. Uh, um, Y'all have to take care of that. And. Uh, maybe probably off screen or camera or whatever to get it to build up properly But let's run back down here to our base real quick, and I think that's probably gonna be it Trying to think of what else do I have stuff on me? Yes, I was like I can place these railings to end it off oh, So we're almost done. I mean obviously I need to add more Items until I gotta get some gas crafted up 
I gotta um, harvest some more silk pearl stuff just to have that. See what I need to use or need to craft, uh, gather up to craft more items like polymer. Um, I know there's obsidian all like on the hills over there, so that won't be hard to get at all. It's just the smitty paste, so I definitely need to get a frog, which means the swamp, which I usually avoid the swamps at all costs, except to get a frog, so that'll probably be in an upcoming video of a trip to the swamp. I'm just going to build this up a little bit higher, maybe one more, because it just, I would like to do it up there, but I want to be able to, you know, fly dinos in it, the RG in and out, so I don't want to cover the top. I want, wanted to, but then I was like, oh yeah, I want to fly the RG in easily, so I probably won't cover it, at least not for now. I may think about it later on. That'll be something I do just some other time. But I think that'll probably be it for the day. Probably a smaller episode, again, of crafting everything. And I'm trying to get stuff crafted up because I want to... I tried taming. So this whole thing started when I tried to tame that um, Diplodocus that was in my base. I don't know if you guys remember it from the past episodes. It was just over and against that rock wall over there by the door. It's been in my base pretty much since I moved into this area and so I decided to tame it and I wasted pretty much all my trank darts I did get more crafted up since then if you see there so I have another stack I have 50 in my inventory another 50 there and 36 so I've been trying to craft up the weapons and stuff so I keep you know gunpowder and narcotic and everything so that's why I want to try and get to the um, chemistry bench so I can you know get it all crafted up and everything but I think that's going to be it for the episode today. So I hope you enjoyed. If you did, let me know in the comments down below. And don't forget to subscribe to see more ARC videos on the Ragnarok server. And we'll see you next time.